Hello beautiful people, how have you been? Welcome to English as it is. In today's class, we'll talk about diphthongs. Diphthongs are part of the IPA. IPA stands for the International Phonetic Alphabet. The IPA has monophthongs, which are the single vowel sounds. The IPA has the diphthongs, which are the double vowel sounds. And the IPA also contains the triphthongs, which are the triple vowel sounds. And then we have consonant sounds in the IPA as well. In today's class, we are talking about diphthongs and we learn all the sounds one by one. The first sound is A. This is a transcription. This is the A sound and this is a short E sound. Together, the sound uh, becomes A and you can hear this sound in words like these. Make. This is a spelling M-A-K-E and we have the A sound in this, the first diphthong sound. And you see that this is M and then we have the A sound and then the K. So together it makes it make, make. Similarly, in this word face, you'll hear the same sound. F-A-C is the spelling and this is the phonetic transcription. Uh, you can find the transcription, the phonetic transcription in every dictionary. In front of the word, uh, the transcription is given. So you can easily find out, but you just need to recognize or know these symbols or learn these symbols. So face is written like this. This is the transcription of face. So the first diphthong is, sound is A. The second diphthong sound, sound is I. So this is the A sound and this is the short E sound. Together it comes to I. And we have words like these, like lie, which has this sound. So lie, L-I-E. Uh, is written like this in uh, this is the phonetic transcription lie l and then i which makes it lie and then we have die so this is a transcription d plus i makes it die so the second sound was i the third sound is oi oi this is the o sound and this is the short e sound oi and in words like these, boy, B-O-Y is the spelling. And this is the transcription, boy, boy. So B plus oi becomes boy. Similarly in toy, T plus oi becomes toy. So the oi sound is there in these words, boy, toy, enjoy, employ. There can be numerous words. The next sound is the O sound. This is a schwa sound, a sh the, the, the shortest vowel, the schwa sound. And the short U sound, which makes it O, and you can hear this sound in words like these, like go, G-O, go is a spelling, and this is a transcription, go, go. Then we have no, so N and then O sound makes it no, so go, no, gold, home, phone, mobile, is the correct pronunciation. The next diphthong is the O sound a uh, this is a uh, and this is short u uh, sound a uh, and in words like this now n o w now is pronounced like now this is a transcription n and then the a uh, sound n plus a uh, makes it now uh, similarly in how h plus a uh, makes it how the spelling is h o w but uh, the transcri the transcription is h and then the a uh, sound which makes it how so now, how, cow, all these words have the same sound, the, the ow, ow sound. The next uh, diphthong is the ear sound. This is short E and this is the sure sound. It makes it ear, ear, ear. And in words like this, fear, fear, this is a transcription. This R is in bracket. It means uh, in British English there is a rule that the last R of a word is not pronounced, it's silent. So it should be pronounced like fear. In American English, this R is pronounced and when you pronounce R, you have to roll your tongue. So in, in American English, it should be pronounced like fear. But in British English, it will be a fear, fear. So this is the ear sound. There's one more example, real, R-E-A-L, and this is the transcription, real, real. Then we have the L sound, a, this is the a sound and this is a schwa sound. Together it makes it a. And in words like this, hair, h a i r, hair, this is a transcription, hair, hair. And then we have there, 
This is the spelling, T-H-E-R-E, -E, and this is the transcription, there, there. The, the, the delta sound and then the air sound makes it there, there. So here, there, like that. And then we have the last diphthong, which is the oo sound. So this is short oo, and this is a shua sound. Together it comes to oo, oo, and in words like this, t-o-u-r, we can hear the sound tour. This is a transcription, t, and then the oo sound, tour, tour. And there's one more word, sure, s-u-r-e, and this is a transcription, sure, the, the sh sound, and then the u, the, the sh, sh and u makes it sure. So u is the last diphthong. So these are all the diphthongs. A, I, O, I, O, 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 I, L, L, and U. I hope you enjoyed the class. Please hit the subscribe and share and like button if you if you if you like the class. If you wanted to, if you really wanted to learn these uh, symbols and sounds. Uh, thank you very much. I'll see you in the next class and we'll learn something new. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.